The local nonprofit in our area is helping children and adults who need medical and physical care. Holy Angels in Belmont officer offers medical services that no one else in the state really has. And WCNC Charlotte's Larry Sprinkle caught up with the CEO to see how these are a staple for some in the community. You may have seen the sign Holy Angels driving down Wilkinson Boulevard here in Belmont, or maybe you've even heard the name. The question, what is Holy Angels? The answer to that question starts with the Sisters of Mercy. Back in December 1955, a very desperate mother brought her infant daughter to the Sisters of Mercy in Belmont. This little baby had a list of physical disabilities. Doctors told her mother that she would only live for a few months. Through the amazing commitment of the Sisters of Mercy, Maria Morrow thrived for 54 years. We are a residential facility that serves adults and children who are differently abled. Co-founders mother Mary Benignus Hoban and sister Patrice Manley worked to accommodate additional children with special needs. And for 67 years, Holy Angels has been there. One of the things that we do really well here is we serve adults and children who have um, pretty complex medical needs and also complex physical needs as well. This one-of-a-kind organization offers programs and special services for both children and adults with intellectual and developmental disabilities and delicate medical conditions. Carrie Massey is the CEO of Holy Angels. Our residents who have highest needs get to go to school and have a teacher teach them everything a normal ch kid is being taught. It is a wonderful, happy place. They have continued to expand other day programs and services to serve more of those in need within the community. Music therapy is a very important part of the day's activities for those who spend their lives at Holy Angels. It gives kids of all ages a chance to enjoy the sounds and to make some music themselves. The Holy Angels Greenhouse offers a great learning opportunity for many of the adults who live on the campus. With the staff assisting, it's all hands-on and a lot of fun. They live, they learn, they have such a special life, and it's all because each one is an angel, and that's really what Holy Angels is all about. Larry Sprinkle, back to you.